Uh, going on six years ago, we met at uh, uh, this young adults church thing with a church that uh, I was playing music for. One time I was alone at the house by myself, and my brother was gone, my other roommate was gone, and, and she invited me. She's like, hey, come hang out. And I was like, yeah, okay, whatever. So we went. And Seth was still tearing down, so I asked him if he wanted to go. I actually didn't think he would say yes. He's kind of a loner and likes to keep to himself. Um, but I didn't have anything to lose, so why not? And I'm pretty poor, so I didn't want to ask him. And, uh... <laughs> And, you know, I, I had always noticed her before because she, I mean, she's gorgeous, so. Uh, but I'm shy. I don't like talking to people, to women especially. But uh, And then uh, she ended up stealing the hat that I was wearing. Well, she did that inside the restaurant. Uh, she's like, oh, I love your hat. Let me try it on. Right? Well, she stole it and put it on. I was like, oh, you pull it off way better than me. Yeah, blah. And then... Uh, Later that night, either him or I messaged each other on Facebook saying, like, by the way, we still have my hat. And I accidentally stole it, and I think he accidentally let me. And so the plan was for me to give it back to him Sunday at church, and it was helping him around here since then. That's right. I, I remember that night. Vivian, remember the first smile she gave me when she put on my hat. It is ingrained in my brain. So, uh, yeah, that's it. That's the story. This is your wedding day. I want you to look around at each face and see these people who love you, who support you, who are so happy that this day has come. That you see different things in different people. I've known you since ninth grade, which you met you at a football game. Um, introduced, uh, Justin introduced me to you. And uh, I hated everybody. I hated the universe. Um, but I can say from that day on, it showed me ways to improve myself, um, ways to love better, to love harder, um, and to not be so angry. You're one of the few people I can unapologetically be myself around. Above all, I treasure your hugs. Thank you for being so wonderful in so many ways. I'm so proud to be by your side as you marry your country bumpkin. I love you so much, sweet girl. So, uh, we've known each other since seventh grade, and I can honestly say from the first day that we became friends, I knew that it was something special because of the, pe the person that you are and the way that you care for people, the way that you love people, and the way that you show people how they mean in your life. And ever since that point, I, I've known that I needed to hang on to a friendship like this. I'm so proud of you. So proud that you found somebody in your life who just makes you smile. It's so crazy. Melinda, do you tonight take Seth as your husband, joining yourself to him, to be a husband, to be a wife to him, <laughs> from from this moment forward, believing that you will be one. I do. Then <laughs> make this declaration of your faith to him. I, Melinda. I, Melinda. Give myself to you. Give myself to you. To be a wife to you. Not a husband. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> From this moment forward, this moment forward. We, shall we shall be one. May I have the bride ring, please? Hmm? Bride ring, please. Hmm? Bride. Bride. Bride ring. I need the. We'll, we'll talk later. <laughs> Seth, you may kiss your bride.